And welcome back to The Factor on Censored. Video of an R-rated wedding reception is going viral. We're still working to learn where this all went down, but this pedicure toe-loving husband, he licked them like, well, and his new bride are getting a lot of attention. Do I think he took a drink and then he's licking the toes. It's your wife, I mean, this couple is clearly comfortable with showing off their love, but how do wedding planners approach a situation like this? Paris Mayfield is here in studio tonight. Paris, when you see some toe sucking and licking like Kentucky Fried Chicken, <laughs> knuckle sucking good at your wedding that you're planning. How do you deal with that, number one, to the attendees who may be offended or caught off guard by it? And what do you tell them in advance, if anything? So most times I tell my couples to, it's your wedding, do what you want to do, be traditional or don't be traditional. So when that takes place, it catches me off guard because I've been working with you all for like a year here. And you ain't know we got and some I freaks in here. I didn't, I don't, I don't. <laughs> so when it happens, I'm just as shocked as everybody else. And, and, and I'll take that back. Not freaks, they're just having fun. They're having fun. They're showing affection. Right. I just, I'm shocked as, I'm as shocked as grandmas, honestly. I'm like, okay, have fun. I always encourage everyone to have fun, so. Do you? Now, I've heard some wedding planners are now putting in a disclaimer for guests saying, mm -hmm. at a certain point, it might get a little wild in here. So be prepared. If you if you don't want to deal with this, leave after 8 o'clock. Yeah, so I do have a lot of brides. They're like, hey, our music is going to get, it's going to get turned up. So mm -hmm. we want our grandmas to leave. But most times, gra grandmas, aunts, they get the picture. Right. Like, once dinner is served, the dances are done, they get out of there, but in the event that they want to stay, I have had an event where they want to stay, and they're just sitting around like, oh, okay. Now, it's the other side of the new family that may be caught off guard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that happens too, and I'm just like, and they don't, but the bride and the groom, they don't care. They're just so, like, obsessed and in love in that moment that they're just having fun. And, and we've seen a lot of things like this. Let's take a look. Here's another viral video, this time the bride at the center of attention. <coughs> she put on a show for her new husband oh. and everyone else in the room throwing back uh, <laughs> on him in a thong. So wait, let's just keep it, let's look and let you talk. So what do you think about, is this too much? Is there such a thing as going too far at your wedding? Oof. The I Lewises, Darian and Monica Lewis, and they're saying, hell yeah. I think that's too far. I do. Uh -huh. I, I definitely, but... Once again, it's, it's their day, so if they want to do that, if she if he's okay with her coming out in front of his mom and his grandma and his aunt with a thong on, bending it over, then, hey, be my guest. And you also have to, like you said, take into consideration your guests. You yes. have a multi-generational wedding yes. on average. Mm -hmm. You have your mother, your grandmother, and, and, and other relatives in there. Be respectful of them. Right, right. That I know right it's there. Your day, but have a little class. That right there. I would tell the videographer, don't, don't go, don't, don't get that. Uh -huh. We don't need that as professional memories. Like, we don't need that part. Right, that ain't professional at all. No, that I wouldn't advise. I would <laughs> never advise that far. And finally, this is a bit more wholesome. This guy having fun at a reception, keeping <laughs> it to the floor with his moves. So, that's okay. Yeah, because or I'm, is it? Or is it? It's okay because I guarantee you, uh, uncles are gonna do that. <laughs> all the all the uncles do that, and That's and me. everyone's That's like, me. okay. <laughs> and it's it's his wife is always somewhere in the corner, like get him up, get him up. <laughs> but yeah, it's she's like I swear for Lord, I can't take it. It's no preference, but then when I feel like people are taking it too far, I'm like, hey, you want to kind of wait till like the twelve o'clock hour when everyone's almost gone to just act a fool, but I would never encourage the whole thong outfit. But you would warn your guests, for sure. Yes. Yes. Elders, respect. Uh -huh. Like, I would be like, this part you may not want to see. Let's go get a beverage or something like that. But I wouldn't, I would be uncomfortable. <laughs> Me. <sighs> I guess they didn't care. You gotta take a breath. Thank you for joining yes, us here.